This is testimony from the borders. We have a new story coming out of America. They're reporting a new zombie drug in America that is taking over America. I don't call this a a, a new zombie drug. I, it, this is another, another zombie drug. There has been many zombie drugs that have gone across America. This is just another one. It's, it is the latest. So what is this drug? Of course, it's lace. It's fentanyl that's mixed with animal tranquilizer and this is the drug that's causing people to slump over they're slumping over and it looks like they're just in a daze and you're going to i want you to see what this drug is doing to people in america of course this drug is running rapid it is all over and the people are being affected by it now look at this this is basically what it makes them do they're slumped they're slumped over and they're just gone out of this world what is happening why is this happening we're about to approach the next person that is just dazed and gone watch this what is this she's standing there as if she's moving but she's standing. It's almost as if she wants to sit. But she's not sitting. And again, they're slumped over. What a nightmare. A serious nightmare. And they're everywhere. Once you go into a major city in America, this is what you will see now. For the ones within the borders, we don't see this. We, when we were in America, we've never seen this before. And Americans hadn't seen this, but now they are, they're used to it. They're used to it. Look like they're looking down at something. And you would think this is an episode of the Twilight Zone, but no, this is the new America. This is normal now in America. And you will see scores and scores of people in the zombie state. We remember what Trump said. He's calling other countries SH whole countries. What, is, what are we looking at here? What are we looking at? Is this, is this progressing with time? Is this a place that's becoming better? Notice normal people walking down the street. They're living their daily lives. And you have, you have people slumped over, sitting on the ground, slumped over, everywhere. This isn't fabricated. This is what's happening in America. The people that are hung, hooked out, hung, strung out on the drug. Look at this one. She's, she just bent to the side. Now look at, look at, like she's sleeping. They're gone. This is something we've never seen. Well, for the ones that have been outside the borders for some time. We've never seen, I've never seen this before. I've never seen a real person doing anything like this. And I mean, they're all over. They're everywhere slumped over sitting over sitting on the ground slumped over now this particular drug it makes their skin deteriorate rotten they get these horrible sores and they eventually will have look at this they eventually will have to amputate arm or legs so you walk down the streets of america this is what you will see and they have the nerve to call another country the third world country? What is that? What are we seeing here? It looks like total failure. You want to talk about total failure? This is a total failure. Who's coming to the rescue? What are we seeing here? Look at her. Is this normal? 
Is this normal? If you see this in your city, is this normal? But yet it has become the norm. Who wants to live like this? Look at this one. He's just slumped over in the chair. Now, the story from the ground, this is the report from the ground. I heard the reports from the ground and what people that live in this neighborhood say. They, they say they take the needles and stick it in their neck, stick it in their arms, stick it anywhere. And then they begin to slump over. This is not normal. This is what, this is what America has come to. Who's going to fix it? Who? Who cares about these people? One thing we know, no one, no one wants to live like this. I haven't met anyone enjoy living life like this. You go to the worst of the worst countries and you won't see anything like this. The people should be outraged, but they are not. This is testimony from the borders.